And today we are going to jump into chapter or episode three, Above the Law. So, uh, yeah, if you was uh, here on Tuesday, you'll remember that as we uh, got to the New Frontiers gates and the gates opened up, we found out that Javi's brother isn't dead and um, is actually in charge of what well, it seems to be in charge of the New Frontier. Now, we uh, we don't know where Clem's gone. Clem didn't want to come with us because obviously something has gone down between herself and the New Frontier. She's got the whole branding that they do uh, on her arm, but clearly something has gone on um in the past and we still don't know what that is but you know we're getting little bits little tidbits of uh clem's story and what's happened to clem since uh, kenny died as we go along but uh without further ado let us jump in to episode number three above the law previously on the walking dead You don't have to fill his cup up anymore, baby. Grandpa is sleeping. No, Yaya. Pippo's awake. Solamente está confundido. Mama. Oh my god! Oh my god! Hey! Put your hands up. Close your eyes. Thanks. Mari! Oh, you shit! Kate! Javi, don't! Hey. What do we call you? Sorry, forgot to introduce myself. It's Paul, but my friends call me Jesus. I fucking knew it. You're one of them? You're goddamn right she is. If you want to shoot me, shoot me. How about I shoot your little boyfriend here instead? Holy shit. What the hell's going on out here? Oh my god. Oh my god. Crazy, thank you very much to the host, buddy. Appreciate it. Alrighty then. Time to find out what's been going on. What's been going on? What's been going on, even? I hate being out so close to dark. It's harder to see them coming. We're just gonna get that propane and then come right back. I, I saw it in that pickup truck parked down the road a little. In front of the Wallace's house. I just wish there was an easier way to get it. And that we didn't have to risk life and limb every damn day. Nothing's easy anymore, Kate. But that doesn't mean we don't have to try. I know. It's just hard to get used to. That's all. We get over there, we grab the tank, and we get the hell back home. If we're lucky, we won't see a single one of those things. <sighs> Fingers crossed. You won't be lucky. Pretty sure. There it is. Uh, I will eventually, yeah. I just don't know what to do at the minute with them, so. Let's take it and go. It's a trap. You've got to be fucking kidding me. God damn it. That's probably not smart, Kate. Of course it's empty. Why would we get that lucky? Hey, keep it down. I know it sucks, Kate, but you got to watch out. I'm sorry. I'm just sick of this shit. I just thought this one time... We deserve to catch a fucking break. 
Uh-oh. Just stun there, Kate. It's fine. You know, I don't need your help or anything. Jeez, Kate. Seriously. Uh, no. I have to cut that out. It's fine. I'm sorry. I was just so fucking scared. You froze. It's useless. It's okay. I wanted to kill it. I really did. But I know him. That was one of Kate's friends. True. He was so sweet. The voice had a smile on his face. Kate worshipped him. That's not true anymore. I know it, it still looks like him, but... The kid you knew, he's gone. All that's left is this... Thing. Thing. I don't even know what to call them. If they're not people. If they're just... The dead. <sighs> Muertos. That's what we'll call them. Muertos. I thought we were gonna die. I thought Gabe and Mariana were just gonna wake up and we would just be gone. We have been sort of developing like a bit of a you? relationship between these I'm two, right so. Here, okay. I'm here. You're here. We're still probably alive. choose the option, which That's is um, you know, getting a bit close to Kate. Can we go back now? Board up the windows. <laughs> Anyone get the reference? I know we all wanted to stay here in the house and wait for David to come back, but it's been three months since he drove away with your mom. What are you saying? We're not safe here. Not anymore. You and I... So they obviously turned around because they were, I think they were following David, weren't they, at, at the beginning? They obviously sort of like turned around and came back to the house, which is interesting. I could have been killed out there for an empty can. There's got to be a safer place out there. Somewhere not so isolated. So, we'll leave. Go somewhere else. Somewhere safer. Somewhere with crazy thick walls, okay? And a gate that's 20 feet tall. You really think the kids are going to be happy with this plan? The kids will understand. A and if they don't, we'll just make them see it our way. We have to go. Forward up the How doors. come? <laughs> what if I don't want to leave? Cabe. We're safe inside the house. And I bet we can find more food in the neighborhood if we just look harder. We need to find somewhere with more people around. People who are still alive. People who don't obviously mind been some, supplies. It's obviously been quite a few years then since like this, this, uh, like the initial outbreak and then where we're actually playing now because obviously the kids are like a lot um, older uh, in our playthrough. Definitely Gabe, he was sort of like mid to late teenager, I would say, I mean, in their current sort of timeline. So, yeah, obviously a lot of time has passed since uh, the outbreak to uh, when we're playing it. We have our own supplies. Not enough. Not anymore. Get that hammer. Bought up the that? doors. What's he going to think if he shows up and we, we just ditched him? We might never find him again. We have to look out for ourselves now, Gabe. I wish things were different. And Chris just hopes that his dad's dead, but our safety's more important. But we're work our way here. around it. No, we're not. I'm sorry, Gabe, but Javi's right. Uh, how about you guys go and I stay here? You're a kid. That's not how it works. I can take care of myself. If I need any help, I'll just ask my friends. Oh, about that, Gabe. Honey. Just smash the face of one of your friends. What? <laughs> we 
What's what's wrong with her? Why is she acting so weird? She's sad. Because when we were out, we saw your friend, Drew. But it wasn't exactly him anymore. You mean he was one of them? We're so sorry, Gabe. You're not taking any like extra insurance out on it, Mika. So you understand why, don't you? Why we have to leave? If that happened to you, I couldn't bear it. Do you like some like gadget insurance or something, maybe just to, to give yourself that peace of mind if you're uh, worried about it. Tomorrow, as soon as it's daylight. I want to leave him a note. I'll help you get started. Okay. What are we gonna tell him? I want to say something good. Something that won't make him sad. Tell him we'll find him. Somehow, we're all gonna see each other again. I like that. I'm gonna write it right now, so we don't forget. Of course. I'll help him. Thank you. Really. Gabe looks like really young in this bit, doesn't he? What's that look for? It was a right dirty look. to know where but Kate says when it's not safe here we're going to find you somehow I'll be promised love Gabe choice between the uh, teddy and the woman and she didn't want them Playing with their ball. Yeah, it's just ball three. Boom. Knock our educated. It's a family photo. Wait, is Tabby not part of the family photo? He just has like a separate photo? Did they really disown him after what had happened? It was that um, Death Wish scholarship. That's what it was. When I got through my, all my abakai. Dad? Javi? Is that really you? <laughs> I always hoped I'd find you. I, I thought you were dead, man. I thought you'd been dead for, for a long time. <laughs> no such luck. I knew you were still alive. I knew it. Hey, weapons down. This is my family. You gotta let us in. Kate doesn't have much longer. Jesus. Kate! David? I'm here, hon. I'm right here. What the hell happened? She's been shot. And we got the bullet out, but she's still bleeding. We need your doctor. Now, David. Thanks, Javi. For getting her here. We're gonna She's coming inside! We're gonna do she turn around and shut the fucking gate on us? Max, you want her to die? No! I didn't say that! Our doctor's gonna help you, honey. I'm gonna make sure of it. Wait, I I'm going with you. Sorry, but the rest of you have to go straight to quarantine. What for? All newcomers get checked made for a decision fights, then on, uh, and which they one all you have want to answer a couple of questions. Our doctor will clear the two of them, but the rest of you have to come with me to the quarantine holding area. If Kate's going to the hospital, then so am I. Not yet. First, you go through quarantine, then we'll see. Ah, this is bullshit. 
Come on. The sooner you come along, the sooner we can get you cleared. Hey, David. Wow, just like a Let's go. Proper like shunned him. Completely ignored him. Also, finally, the rain has turned up. Plants meant to have been like raining all day. Instead, we've had like glorious sunshine, weirdly, here. Trip. Oh, God! Eleanor! When we found the car without you in it, I didn't know what to think. The engine up and died. Yeah, he's I buying a game in that for boy, and This happened. I've been so worried about Kate. I told them she needed a doctor. They promised me someone would look into it. Please, tell me they found her. They definitely didn't look for her. Because she was still in the car. But that's crazy! I told them she was dying! And clearly it wasn't a priority. Well, at least those assholes realized she needed a hospital once they saw her. I'm sorry, Javi. Really, but... No, I mean, I just treat it crazy. Reason not, not to all. believe them. What? The people oh, here, Doctor, what's going on? I'm good, thank you, self. New frontier. Oh my God! Oh, ho, ho, you ain't even heard the worst part yet. One of them's his brother. I didn't even know you had a brother, Javi. Hey, nobody's more surprised than me. I, I thought the guy was dead. We haven't seen David in years. It's just been me, Kate, and the kids this whole time. I don't even want to think about what the odds are, but he did seem pretty damn surprised to see you. Whoever this guy is, he can't be all bad, right? Hmm. I mean, he helped Kate instead of hauling her down here. Of course he brought her inside. She's his damn wife. You're kidding. Kate is married to your brother? The way you two acted around each other. The only reason I know Kate is because she married David. I was the best man at their wedding. Wow. Okay. Yeah, the, re the reason for that, though, Crazy, is because um, laptops aren't really upgradable. With a, P a PC, um, you can still, like, swap out parts as and when things become older, but laptops, you can't really do a lot other than, like, upgrade a bit of RAM without spending like, serious money. On them, so um, that's why laptops are more gaming laptops. Anyway, are more um, expensive in my opinion because they have to they have to last longer than PCs. God, hope you know I'm not about to make nice with New Frontier. I know you didn't have much stake in Prescott Hobby, but they burned that place to the ground for no fucking reason. After everything you folks told me, I'm guessing I'm not going to find my people alive. Hell, Hobby, they killed your niece. Shot Kate! For all we know, your brother could have been behind it. And even if it wasn't his idea in the first place, if he knew about it and didn't stop it, that shit can't stand. I hate to admit it, but there's a chance he gave the order. If he didn't know it was them, if he was just trying to get payback, That's not good was stolen. It's possible. What was he like when you knew? You guys get along? He seemed happy enough to see you up there. At least at really? first. If you want to hear me say he's an asshole, fine. He's the biggest asshole I know. Question is, is he a big enough asshole to go along with some of the shit they've done? If your brother knew anything about what happened at Prescott, he's got to answer for it. They all do. I owe that to Conrad. Oh. Wow. I'm not just gonna let things slide. I've never really been an eye for eye kind of man. But people died. We need to even out the scales. We need to look like we're playing along with their rules. But the thing is, I have death, which people don't want the computers, they just want the graphics cards, so. When the time is right, that's when we demand justice. Hey. Hey. How much of that did I you just hear? Sooner, but I had to take care of something 
Come on already. Kate's asking for you. Maybe you think it's okay to keep a lady waiting. Thought I taught you better than that. What about the rest of my friends? They're not invited. Hurry up now. Looks like the rules don't apply to everyone, huh? That's right. Some people get out of here early. Others stay a long fucking time. Trip, just drop it, okay? Smart cookie, this one. Javi, just go. I'll put in a good word for you, okay? See if we can't hurry the process along a bit. Thanks. Awkward. Awkward, awkward, awkward. Yeah, I'd probably go with the HP Omen, to be fair. I've, I've at least heard of the Omen. Along with them I've seen now. some bits Doesn't and pieces about it. Can't comment on the little over process. Our own way of doing things. Your guys better not have a problem with that. Things don't go well for troublemakers here. I hope that's clear. David, you threw us in a cell. Don't expect us to smile about it. We do that to protect our people. It's not personal. You sure about that? Come on. Where are we going? Kate asked for you. I thought you'd want to check on her. Listen, Javi, Gabe. He told me some pretty messed up things. Things I need your help wrapping my head around. He shouldn't have done that. I wanted to tell you myself. Bad news is bad news. Who cares who delivers it? He told me you lost Mariana. Just a few days ago. Yeah, from one of your guys. Oh. I'm sorry, David. She's... She's gone. Tell him the rest of the thing. Avi. It's strange grieving for the same person twice. Like losing something you didn't know you had. What was she like, Javi? She was so little when we got separated. Who did my little girl become? We got along well. Her smile kept me going through a lot of rough times. That... must have been nice. How... How did she die? Telling the truth. Come on, one of your guys. She was just standing there, minding her own business. She just found her lost headphones in the dirt. She was smiling. And then someone put a bullet in her head. What kind of animal would just open fire on her like that? An animal with your mark. My people aren't in the habit of killing little girls. On David, a I was there. They shot Kate too. Ask your buddy at the gate if you'll believe me. Max was a part of this? Fuck. I need details. What the hell went down out there? I need to know exactly what happened. Everything you remember. They ambushed us in a junkyard. Just unloaded on us. They chased us back to this town, Prescott. Their leader flooded it with walkers and, and tear gas. Leader? A crazy bald guy with a beard. Badger, what the fuck have you done now? I'm gonna handle that stupid son of a bitch, okay? Do me a favor, keep this to yourself. The politics here, they can get messy. I thought you were the boss. There's four of us that run, Richmond. You need to impress the other three. Or you'll be back on the road by morning. So it seems almost like this like new frontier has almost like little breakaway factions who seem to be kind of like doing their own thing. And like the people who are running the town don't necessarily know what they're up to, so that's quite interesting. 
Try not to stir things up. You and your friends could have a very short stay. You wouldn't let that happen, would you? We only just got here. It's not just up to me. I run security here, but it's not like my word is law. This shit with Badger doesn't make things any easier. Oh, that's she. It's her. That's the one who uh, met Clement. Ava, this is my brother, Javi. The baseball brother? <laughs> no shit. What are the chances of you turning up on the doorstep? Welcome to civilization. My brother talked about me. All the time at the start. All good, I hope. I think you know the answer to that. No. <laughs> Ava's my right hand. If there's anyone you can trust in Richmond, it's her. That woman, the fucking soldier. She was the first person I met up with after you and me got separated. I never would have made it without her. Gabe said you went back to the house. At the start. I'm sorry I never found you. Did you get his laugh? We waited for you for three months. Eventually, the house was overrun and we had to move. Why didn't you come back? Mama and I got routed out of the city on the way to the hospital. It wasn't long before she... Poor Mama. I couldn't get back into Baltimore, so I hooked up with my old unit. We thought we could build a safe zone outside D.C. After what happened to Mama and everyone else, I thought you were all dead. But you were taking care of them, weren't you? Oh, yeah, more ways. Somehow you found a way. I'm not gonna lie. I never thought you had it in you. We took care of each other. And we all had each other's backs. You've changed, brother. It took the end of the world. But you finally grew up. This is where they're treating Kate. Don't get comfortable. We're not staying long. All right, so you have to appreciate almost like the person that we've turned into now a little bit more, but it still feels like we've uh, got a load of uh, hey, got a load hey, of trash kid. about us. Got everything you need? Uh, yeah. This place is like a resort. Check it out, Javi. Noodles in a cup. We need to get you some real food. I, I, like I said, I don't know a lot about Lenovo's, but I I do feel like they are probably better business laptops um, but I don't know what they're like for sort of like personal use or for like gaming that turn you into a soldier <laughs> I looks like you lost your son uh, Javi I'm glad you're okay who will Kate choose <laughs> you <love me. laughs> I was gonna say the same about you It's good to have you back. Look at this family. Look at my wife. Hmm. Isn't she the most beautiful woman Awkward. alive? Come on. With the lights off, you could mistake me for a walker. A damn fine walker. You're a lucky man, David. We're all lucky. Oh, wow, this is oh, oh, shit. I'll get the dock. I'm fine. Faked it. <laughs> I didn't have to talk to you alone. I'm scared, Javi. More than I was the whole time on the road. Even when I thought I was going to die. Everything inside me screams to get away from here. These people are killers. Surely David's got to realize, like, it's been years. And, you know, Javi and Kate have been rolling as this, like, like man and woman, husband and wife sort of team. Surely you gotta realize that things may have happened and you can't just like kiss and make up and pretend that the last few years haven't happened. Same. And David? Yeah, I know what you mean. This place gives me the creeps. <sighs> I'm glad to hear that. I was afraid you'd been won over by the security here. It's always been you and me on the road, Javi. That's how we've made it this far. 
Please, promise me we'll go back to that the first chance we get. This place, it's a cage. We can't let ourselves get locked in. It's going to get bad if we stay. I'll find the way, Kate. You have my word. Rest up. You're gonna need your strength. Get about, Thanks. David. I feel better. Knowing we're in this together. But please hurry. I I don't want to be left alone here. Feeling better? How you doing, sweetheart? David reported some pain. It's less now. Strange how it just comes and goes. <laughs> I think she pulled her stitches when she sat up. Her stitches? I doubt it. But pain often comes in waves with abdominal wounds. Hmm. <laughs> I'll give you something to take the edge off, in case it comes back. Truly superlative work. The David's already I'd given us the operate, evils. All she needed was IV fluids and some antibiotics. How did you find someone with skills like these? A wound like this kills 9 out of 10. Whoever did this really knows their stuff. That would be Eleanor, one of my friends you threw in quarantine. Well, she's no use to anyone there. We should let her out. I'll vouch for her. Agreed. I'll have Ava bring her here. I want to meet this Eleanor. I'm sure she'll be an asset to our community. You can vouch for the rest of them too, right? It doesn't work that way, but we'll make the case for them soon. Javi and I have to go meet some people now. See if we can't prove he's worth a damn. We're gonna take real good care of you. I'd rather just, okay. you know, not give a crap here and just get chucked back out on the street. David. I won't be able to make it. The thing is, though, David, David probably won't um, allow Kate to be thrown back out or Gabe to be thrown out on the street. So then, like, he would be on his own with Trip and Eleanor and Jesus. So, yeah, it's kind of a catch twenty-two, I guess. Feeling okay? Fine. I just want to keep an eye on my patient. The others know my vote is with you. Come on. Remember what I said. When we meet these guys, keep what happened to Mariana to yourself. Badger is one of my guys. And I will handle him. Hmm. Who are you? Bit like a cover up for me. Yeah, those two are brothers, Doctress. It may look pretty, but it's all sugars. There's no substance. It tastes pretty, Clint. That's all that matters. Ah, the brother. Javi, meet the guys. Clint runs food production. The crops you saw, that's him and his people. Jones, our bridge to the outside world. She handles contact with other settlements. Pleased to meet you, Javi. Other I trust you've been treated well. I hope you haven't been handled too roughly. Some of our people left their courtesy with their old lives. <laughs> oh yeah, the cell you threw me in was totally five star. I'm sorry about that. <laughs> we have to be careful. I'm sure you can understand. <laughs> we were just about to eat. Clint was trying to convince me of the essential superiority of his cream spinach over my magnificent Black Forest Gateau. It's no contest. The spinach has real nutritional value. Javi, take a look at that table. You tell me what you'd rather put in your belly. Spinach from um, Clint's garden or, or a baked delicacy by yours truly? I'd have to go with that cake. I haven't seen anything like that in years. Well, the cake is a lie. Come on, Clint. At least he's being honest. Please, make yourself comfortable. We value straight talk here, so please, forgive me if I seem direct. How we look like Chad? pretty strict about who we open our doors to. Chad who? Your brother's word counts for a lot. Is that so? The three of us and Dr. Lingard make all the decisions here, so... Yeah. People who choose to stay with us, they have to deal with us bossing them around. Not saying you wouldn't, but it can be an adjustment. 
Well, if people Especially are alive, morning, people will adjust, right? I mean, like we sort of said, I, I said at the beginning of the stream, there's, there must be like quite a few years have passed since the initial outbreak to like here because Gabe has like grown up quite a lot. So obviously in that amount of time, you learn to adapt. I mean, you're still going to have, you're probably still going to have come up, you're going to, sorry, you're going to have come up with like alternative power supplies possibly. So <laughs> um, anything's possible with enough time. An adaption. No structure out there now. People get used to doing as they please. People telling me what to do usually rubs me the wrong way. Most feel that way when they first arrive. Usually they learn we have their best interests at heart. And those that don't? We ask them to leave. When Joan and I met your brother, he was trying his hand at fruit. Fruit? We found him slowly murdering an orchard on the Shenandoah River. Hotty fucking ha. Huh? I helped him bring it back to life. We had a good run there. For as long as it lasted. Cake in a box. What happened? That's what it was. What always happens. We trusted the wrong damn people. That's what led us to start this. Wondering what this fine piece of body art is all about? It's our litmus test for loyalty. I've seen that mark a few times. You probably saw it at the gates. Right, Javi? Hmm. We all took it as a sign of commitment. It was a crude answer to a difficult problem, and it hasn't always worked. Please understand. We had a terrible winter just after we moved here. We... we lost a great deal. Loved ones who left holes in our lives. Protecting my people from that kind of pain, that's what keeps me awake at night. It turned me into a perpetual night owl. I know it's a lot to ask, but I never want them to have to experience loss like that again. I know how you feel. Seeing the people I care about suffer it. It's a terrible feeling. I just want to shield them from it all. It's a noble aim. One worth fighting for. Uh oh. Shit's about Max. to go down. What are you doing here? I sent for him. Since when does he answer to you? From what I hear, he's well acquainted with your brother. They exchanged a few bullets outside our walls. Is that right? Is there bad blood between you and Max? Nothing that can't be worked out. Let's just say I wouldn't invite him to my wedding. Yeah, I wouldn't fucking go. Good, because I just said you wouldn't be invited. Max, how did this start? Don't look at him. You have an obligation to tell the truth. We caught him siphoning gas from one of our vehicles. Max. Sorry, David. I know he's family, but your brother's a thief. Is it true? Answer her. I was scavenging whatever I could find. I had no idea it belonged to you. If you just asked, we'd have given it to you. That's more your machine, Doctor. That, that's not all. He shot Rufus in the back. You did what? We found the body near the wreck of Rufus's truck. You cold cocked me with your pistol. I woke up in a truck with cable ties on my wrists. That don't make it right. Rufus was bringing you here. We wasn't going to hurt you. This is who you're asking us to vouch for, David? Seriously? You know we can't just open our doors to killers. We're trying to build something different here. Something resembling civilization. Everything I did out there was to protect my people. That's more than I can say for you. I'm not sure what you mean. Javi? You have something to say? Yeah. Yeah. Let's do it. One of your people. Yeah, come on. Badger. He put a bullet in a little girl. My niece. David's daughter. What? Damn it, Javi. I told you I'd handle it. No, David. This cousin fucking dirtbag has the balls to accuse me. He and Badger destroyed an entire town. That's enough. No. We need to hear this. Go on, Javi. Sounds like you've got more to get off your chest. They killed a hostage in cold blood. A woman, Francine. Badger did that, not me. You were right there next to him. I tried to get him to stop, I swear. Cut off her damn finger first. Max. I tried to stop him, I swear. He was out of control. David, we warned you about getting your soldiers in line. We don't know all the facts. We know enough. She's right, David. 
You've lost control. I want them gone. All of them. Take Javi and everyone in the quarantine to the gate. Send them out with enough weapons to defend themselves, but no more. They're like crazy. Looks like we didn't make no friends. Look, we can't fight this. Not now. Kate and Gabe will be safe here. Your doctor friend, too. But the rest of you, you're gonna have to do what they say. I'm sorry. It's out of my hands. Are you fucking kidding me? Just play along, okay? I'll help you when I can. Just stay alive. Okay? Wow. Just like that. Thrown out. Well, I think I'd rather be on the outside than in that um, corrupt and twisted community, to be fair. I've heard people from Richmond aren't that nice, anyway. You're lucky I don't gouge your fucking eyes out with my thumbs. You hear me, asshole? See it crazy. Where's all my weapons that he was gonna give me? Oh, there we go. David packed this. He did. They said. Start walking. What about Eleanor? Walk. Eat shit. Answer my fucking question. God damn it, Harvey! Let go of me! This isn't her fault, Trip. You're mad at the wrong person. Yikes. Right hook. Do not fuck this up. There's a settlement a few miles west of here. Don't come back. So, where's all, like, the soldiers that were going to be kicked out as well? Didn't, like, that woman say to David that we couldn't stay and they were going to kick all the soldiers out as well because they'd lost the plot and he'd lost control of them? Where's the rest of them? Come on, Jesus. Did you Do piss something. in someone's oatmeal back there? I thought you were going to play along. We trusted you. What the hell, man? Ay, Dios mío. Do you ever shut up? Occasionally. Let's just see what they gave us. Knowing them, it's probably a butter knife and a stick of gum. They could have just shot us. More than once. Oh, how fucking neighborly. All right, what have we got in the duffel bag? What's that? He's pulled back with a map on it. it. Looks like a map. I doubt they give one to everyone. Ava did say David packed the bag. Why the hell is it tied to a baseball bat? David's sense of humor was always poorly timed. Looks like they're expanding. Some of these areas are marked clear. Pretty sure David wants us to go there. We don't even know where the hell we are on this thing. Okay. There's Richmond. That helps. That's where we are. And that's where we need to go. Just gotta head north. And to find north, we need to find the North Star. Looks a bit cloudy though, Jesus. Saying. That's it. We need to go this way. What else is in there? Not a whole lot. Flashlight. Not enough weapons. No food. Let's go. Trip, come on. What's up? I can't lose anyone else. I'm telling you. I can't. Prescott, Conrad, maybe Eleanor. It's too much. You won't lose anyone else. I won't let that happen. I'm gonna hold you to that, Javi. 
sorry, man. Rough day, to say the least. I know you got my back. And I got yours. Of course. After you. I'm not sure you need, like, need to point your guns at us when you've only given us like a baseball bat, a knife and an axe. What are we really going to do? Not like we're going to storm the place, is it? To be honest. I gotta tell you, man. I thought you and Kate were, you know. I wouldn't have guessed she was married to not you. I ain't judging, mind you. I'm just curious. What's the story? Ain't my business, I know, but... Well, you know, zombie apocalypse, husband's left us, I'm left with her and the kids, and we get jiggy-jiggy. What, what, what more is there to explain? I... Hey, man, it's alright. Go for it. I do have feelings for her. Maybe I shouldn't, but that doesn't just make him go away. Uh, no harm in saying it. Hell, only real harm's in not saying it when you should. It's always a mess, ain't it? What's that? Who you love, who loves you. If they're one and the same or otherwise. You know what I mean? <laughs> just when you think you got everything figured out. Boom. Cart goes ass over tea kettle. Well, if it wasn't messy, it wouldn't be important, right? Maybe. Yeah, maybe. Just saying, man. Three things that never hide forever. The sun, the moon, and the truth. Eleanor and I, we were... something at some point. But nothing now. I respect her wishes. I really do. I just wish my heart respected mine. Jesus found Jesus something. Jesus got his eye on something. What you got for us, man? Listen. Tell me that isn't what I think it is. About a quarter mile out. Heading the same way we are. Well, we could hit walkers any second. <laughs> you better scoot. Looks like Look we found them. People. I got them. Oh, Jesus. Too complacent. <laughs> See, I told you, too complacent. back good old Ava oh it's Clem I thought it was Ava Clem's back to save the day we're even now I thought you were getting out of here 
I was. The walkers are everywhere. I had to cover myself in walker guts to get away. Come on. Nice. I'm to a factory nearby. Should be safe. I thought you were going to Richmond. New Frontier kick you out? Doesn't surprise me. Not one bit. Not all of us. Kate and Gabe are still there. With David. David? That asshole's still around? This is gonna sound really weird, but... He's my brother. What? Wait, this place we're going? David sent you there? It's supposed to be safe. Clem! You can't trust him, Javi. I learned that the hard way. Oh, there we go. We're gonna find out some more. What went down between Clem I and David. I to need people again. But I had nowhere else to go. The new frontier gave me this and made me one of them. They promised they'd help him. That turned out to be a lie. What about AJ? so hot. Um. What's with her mouth when she's humming? normally packaged before you use them. Vancomycin. That's the last of it. It'll be wasted on AJ. Wow. I told you. It could save someone's life if used right. It's too valuable to throw away. It's the only thing that can save him. Except it can't. I'm sorry, Clem. I tried everything. I, I really did. This will help him get better. Nothing can help your boy now. The drugs back before anyone finds out you took them. You know what they do to thieves here. There's still time. I have to try. What the hell was that? Come on, goofball. I need you to be brave. Yeah, somebody said, okay. What the hell was that? Shh, shh. See? It's not so bad. Not so bad. AJ, shh. 
What the hell is this? I told her it was a bad idea. Are you fucking high again? Pull yourself together before the others see you. Deal with the damn kid. What the fuck were you thinking? You were told those drugs couldn't help him. How could you be so stupid? So selfish? I had nothing left to lose. AJ was gonna die if I didn't. He's gonna <laughs> die anyway. That waste? That'll cost someone's life down the road. Someone in this camp. Someone who contributes to our survival. Come on, David. She was just trying to help her kid. We helped enough! We should have left him out in the woods a week ago! But look! It's helping! It doesn't work that way, Clem. You bought him a peaceful moment. <laughs> Nothing more. I wish I could tell you it would save him. But that's the reality. That's more than you did, any of you. That's not fair. You ungrateful little shit. We opened our arms to you, made you one of us. This is how you repay us? By stealing? By putting yourself before the group? You're done here. You broke our rules, Clem. Violated our trust. You know what? Fuck you. And fuck the new frontier. You already did. That's why you have to go. Maybe we should give her another chance. Don't fight me on this, Paul. You know what Joan would say if she were here. I'm sorry, Clem. You brought this on yourself. Come on, AJ. We don't need this place anyway. Uh-uh. He stays. Can't take him with you. That ship has sailed. Get out of my fucking way. Right now. Clem. He's in no condition to travel. Let him go, Clem. He'll only drag you down out there. Wow. Brutal. No! You monsters! What about this? What was it all for? Don't forget, I'm one of you. So let's just give the no. baby to like the guy who's high on drugs. Great plan. Let her say goodbye. We owe her that much, at least. Fine. You heard her. Say what you need to say, then you go. Please don't make me regret this. Screw over, screw over one kid to save another kid. It's, um... Nothing right. I thought AJ would be the one. Finally. The one what? The one who didn't die. I mean, as, as much as I love Clem and I want to defend Clem, she did kind of steal from them, I guess. Um, but it's kind of a hard situation, really, because um, obviously she's stole from them and their obviously policies are, you know, you steal from us, you don't act as part of the group, we're going to kick you out. But on the other, on the other sort of side of that, she doesn't feel like they've done enough to try and help AJ. So she was taking it into her own hands to try and help him and, and to help you know, give him the best chance of survival. So it's um, it's a bit of a catch-22 there because she's kind of damned if she does, damned if she doesn't. Because if she doesn't and she plays ball, they've basically washed their hands with AJ and like helping AJ. So, you know, he, he's got no chance at all. So, yeah. Whatever the outcome there, it just feels to me like AJ is screwed. Real shame.
this is what David circled on the map. Our smelly friends are back. Thirteen. Let's see why you would like waste your time um, by hitting hit one that was already on the floor. What's the bad doctors? If too many of them push against this, it might give. Gotta find a way in. Break on the floor. A garage door. Might be able to get in that way. It could be full of walkers. Only one way to know for sure. Oh man, this thing ain't as strong as we thought. Hurry it up. I would love to. Here they come. I can. Uh, fuck. I can raise it a little, but I don't know, something's wrong with it. Jammed or some shit. Maybe we can force it open. Ow. We're gonna have to. Jack. We can use that floor, Jack, to lift up the garage door. The handle's missing. <laughs> shit! God damn it! And the handle just happens to be in the car, of course. As fast as I can, Jesus. Why doesn't the car like drop to the floor since I've removed the jack? Am I the only one that's like. It's not holding! I get that door open! That's it! Won't go any higher! Everyone get in! Come on, Jesus! Time to go! Trip. Is Trip gonna sacrifice himself? Hopefully that door holds him. Hey, I'm here! David! Fuck him. Don't you dare let that fucking baby killer in. <gasps> Don't make me do this. Clem. Don't do it, Javi. Hey, open up! He'll die. He deserves worse. I thought you were a good man. We need to barricade the door. Did you let him turn? Tell me! Answer her question. Now. We didn't have to worry about that. What the hell does that mean? He lived, Clem. AJ's alive. I probably saved his life and you kicked me out the new frontier, man. What Clem's thinking right now. But how? He was dying. Clem said so. AJ bounced back. He was stronger than we thought. It was a miracle. You're lying.
That's great. Clem, this is good news. How am I supposed to believe you? Clementine, please, I'm telling the truth. Where? Where is AJ now? I don't know for sure. But he's in Richmond. It's probably just some background process. If he was like running a Dr. virus Lindgren scan or something, maybe it was that just then um, conflicting a little bit, Doctress. Then I'm going back. None of us are going anywhere until the walker's clear. What's your plan, David? We used to store a vehicle up this way. Provisions. I came to get you set up. And? And say goodbye. I don't want you to worry about Kate and Gabe. I'll take care of my family from now on. They'll be safe with me. Not happening, David. They're my family as much as yours. Is that what you think? Last I checked, Kate was my wife and Gabe was my son. Where have you been for the last God knows how many Shit, years, David? Huh. We need something to buffer. Something heavy. Jesus is kick ass. There. Help me. I said maybe if he was running a virus scan, maybe that uh, background process was like slowing Over things there. and causing delays and stuff. Show me. Ah. Well, looky here. People have been stealing from Prescott's. Is all this? This is what your people have been doing. But these could come in handy. Don't want to just take them, but I might be going crazy, but I think these came from Prescott. Different the arcade machine did. That's Phantom Punch. I don't understand how all this got here. Like you don't know. Hey, none of this stuff was here before. I don't have a damn thing to do with it. We've only ever kept a few basic supplies here for scouts, for emergencies. Your people looted this stuff from Prescott, David. Come on, we can't know that. Who else knew about this place? Your outfit is the only one that gutted my town. This is bigger than just Prescott. There's spoils from other towns here, too. Towns I heard got raided a while back. There, there's stuff here from the kingdom. <laughs> Take cover. Fuck him. I'd do that little bitch again just to see her head pop. You sure as hell are stupid, ain't you? Leave me now, David. Realizing that now? I told you. Joan is on the warpath. Last thing we need is people getting wind of all this stuff. Look at all this shit. We're freaking rolling in it. I'll give you that. Just glad we found some more smokes. That shit is the new gold. So you'll have And now pop. we get to see your head pop, you piece of shit. David! I thought better of you, Max. I really did. David, come on, man. We're a unit. There's no need for... <laughs> He's getting away! Go! Get Badger! Home run! Dive into the plate. It coming. Oh, press the wrong button. We got a shotgun to the head. Oh, <laughs> 
We should have the junkyard. You better not let a fly in my way. If I'd have known you were David's brother, I'd have shoved that gas can down your throat and lit you up like a candle. But this'll do. Son. Fucking Garcias! Oh, you, you, you shook my goddamn guts out. Um, um, fuck. This is for Mariana. She was a sweet little girl, just Bats. minding her own business. Around the head. Get them. Not anymore. Fuck her, and fuck you too. Indeed, Mikey. Indeed, what's going on, buddy? I hope you're well. Get it over with. Even Trip agrees. Come look, on. let's do it. What do it. For? Do it now. Come on. What are you waiting for? We gotta move. No point drawing it out. <laughs> Boom. Good here, man. Yeah, it's always That's a good enough, day when man. you're crushing someone's skull. I'm off the road. For God's sake, Hobby. <laughs> Dave's dead. Dave's gonna die. He's all yours. Nineteen thousand five hundred and forty eight. Raiding, looting, you betrayed who we are. You betrayed Richmond. Yeah, it's very brutal, Mika, I agree. This is Richmond. What's that supposed to mean? What's that supposed to mean? I ain't got nothing to say. There's no use holding out, Max. The best you can do is make things right. We we weren't doing it without support inside Richmond. Who's the Joan one, then? was in on it. Joan. We did it on her orders. She she said we needed it to survive. I wanted to let you in, but she told me you'd never go for it. I'm I'm sorry. It is too late for sorry, you backstabbing shitbag. Please don't kill me. I'll help you. I'll, I'll tell everyone in Richmond about this. He's I'll help agent. you get back inside. It's wow. who's hurt of the others. Maybe he'll be useful. Thank you. Thank you. Much pistol whip here instead. You know. I needed that. Time to go. Where's Lonnie? He gave us the slip. Hightailed it back towards Richmond. Son of a bitch. If he warns Joan. Wasn't there one more? There was. Oh. <laughs> what? It's good riddance. <laughs> that son of a bitch killed Mariana. Did that make you feel better? I wouldn't shed any tears if I were you. Maybe I'm shedding them for your brother. Hey, man. Back the fuck off. I don't need a lecture from you. You need it from someone. You don't want to become the thing you hate. Javi's earned my trust. And if any of you had any brains, you'd say the same. I'm sure you did the right thing. Sometimes there's just no other way to make things right. I like Jesus' my character. My a crowbar to someone once. My people need to know about what we found here. What about your missing friends? 
I'm surprised you care. Human life isn't exactly high on your list of priorities. Don't have time to keep looking. They'd want me to get home and warn them. So that's what I'm gonna do. Sooner the better. You sure you won't stay? We need your help. So yeah. do others. I won't forget about you. You have my word. It's a shitstorm out there, man. I don't see how you're gonna make it. One step at a time. Walks around and gets blown away in the face. We need to get back to <laughs> Richmond fast. I have loved ones in there. We both do. We all do. I gotta break Eleanor out of there. Once she's safe, I... I'm gonna tell her how I feel. You said it yourself. If it ain't messy, it wouldn't be important, right? We're gonna need allies in Richmond. Lingard and Clint, they're our best bet. If I can get to them before Joan does, maybe we have a chance. I know I was ready to say goodbye before, but I can't do this without you. Can Heard I count on you? I won't be able to pull this off myself. I'll back you up, but I'm doing this for Kate, not you. Fine. As long as we get it done. If Lonnie raises Screw the alarm, you, they'll be waiting for us at the gates. I'm the one who wants to be. There's a way in round back. Thing I'm in with you, Mrs. We can take Badger's truck. I doubt he'll mind. Come on, we gotta get on the move. Herd's closing in. Right at the wind, bullseye. Seems like a doctress. How old will AJ be though? That's the thing, we don't know how long it's passed of course, but it'll be quite interesting to see, won't it? I'm thinking this will go a lot better if we split up. A group this big can't exactly sneak around, particularly if they're expecting us. Eleanor's in there somewhere. I'm going after her. Lingard brought her to the clinic. That's your best bet. Javi, that's where you'll go to get Kate and Gabe. Then bring them to my house. It's the one with the raven on the hitch I ain't bringing him. I ain't bringing him to your house. There. We're out of here. After I pay a little visit to Joan. Stay out of sight. They'll be keeping an eye out for us. Just don't wait up for me, okay? Javi? I'm gonna do whatever I have to to keep Kate and Gabe safe. After that, I'm not promising anything. Javi, just follow the plan. I'm counting on you to hold up your end. I'll scout ahead. He's gonna leave him with his like hands tied together. Is that it? What about you, Clem? I'm pretty sure I've still got some friends in the New Frontier. If they know where AJ's being held, they'll tell me. As soon as I find him. Taking that truck and getting the hell out of here. Well, you are owed a vehicle. Keep an eye on David. He may be playing nice, but I'd still watch your back. I'm with you, Clint. He rubs me the wrong way. As soon as I get Kate and Gabe, I'm gonna figure out what's best for us. Huh? Best I about 500 miles south of Richmond. Did somebody say Debbie. something about trying to go to Florida Your or something at some right point? Most of the time. I know you'll make the right call. See you when I see you. UTFN. David said to hang a ride up at that corner. Seems clear so far. Let's move. Nice. Burger man or a burger? You know Javi Garcia? He used to play shortstop for Baltimore. That Javier Garcia? Oh, for straight at all. <laughs> That's who we're looking for. I'm perfectly yeah. fine. That Javier Garcia. Anyway, sounds like some paranoid horse shit. Guy's a fucking ball player. There's the medical center. 
We go yeah, in, good. we get out, we get Kate and Gabe, we get out. What about our friends there? Doesn't exactly look like a welcoming committee. All right. Let's hang out here for a while. We'll smoke break. Damn it. We need a distraction. How's your throwing arm? In a while. I'm not sure the power, do I? What the hell was that? Let's check it out. You go first. I'll see. Still got it. I don't want to the power out because then that'll just affect the whole thing and may even uh, have adverse effects on Kate's recovery. So we don't want to do that. Definitely not. Find out. Tell her we have to move, Kate. You got it. I'll meet you here. Javi! We thought you were... I was... super worried. Like, a lot. We have to leave, Gabe. Now. Oh. Okay. I'm sorry. They said you guys were denied entry. It's true. We're on borrowed time. The people who run this place, they're ruthless. We have to move. Where's my dad? Is he coming? Um. Javi, where is he? Your dad's taking care of a few loose ends. And right now, he needs me to take care of you. Oh, OK. David has a house in town. He thinks we'll be okay Eating the bowl. Then let's go. Wait, Javi. While you were gone, this woman, Joan, came by. I felt like she was sizing me up. It was creepy. She implied David was in trouble. Like he was no longer in charge. She kept saying Gabe and I didn't need to worry, but it only made me worry more. Joan's been running this place behind David's back. She's pulling the strings. What do you mean? The people who shot you? Answer to her. She ordered raids on other settlements. It was just we found all this it. stuff from Prescott. She Calling was it behind now. Prescott? Calling it. David's rounding up allies to confront her right now. Javi, I know you know this already. This is not our fight. We already lost Mari because of these people. Now, the whole place is about to become a war zone. What? W what do you mean? The only thing I care about is keeping you safe. Then you know we can't get involved. What's going on? Tripp said we had to go to David's house. We're not doing that. We're getting the fuck out of Richmond before it's too late. Getting out? You shouldn't even be sitting up. What? What about my dad? We can't just leave him. Gabe, we don't even know who he is anymore. We have to get away before he gets us all killed. But he won't know where we are. Again. I can't go back to how things were before. I'm sorry. I just can't. Oh. Implies that um, you know, she was out of love with him. And didn't want to be with him. So that's interesting. I'm sorry, Gabe. But we have to get out of here. If we're leaving, I've got to get some things for the road. All my stuff is stashed in the room they gave me. I'll come with you. We'll catch up with you guys. Sounds good. <laughs> Gabe, come help. I got it. Come on, buddy. I'm not going, Javi. <sighs> what? I'm gonna find my dad. Oh, you wanna wanna come? I have to. Gabe. Please don't do this. I'm sorry. I love you, Uncle Javi, but this is something I have to do. I did that fight I was trying to do after the stream the other night, uh, Doctress. I think I'm um, 
Uh, I'm on chapter 9, which is like halfway through the game. So, yeah, it's going well, thanks. It's going pretty well. Just taking quite a bit of practice in between. Um, so, I think like she just, she just wanted to like stick to herself because of the whole AJ thing. Like AJ was taken away by the New Frontier. And she was left on her own so she kind of like from that she's like okay well it's every every person for themselves then and you know i don't need to be with anybody so i think a lot of her current character and then want the fact that she wants to be on her own and, and do things her way is just the way and the fallout from the way she was treated from the new frontier and i think like that's why she just wants to be on her own protect herself and not have to worry about other people because she doesn't trust other people anymore the fact that you know, they just screwing her over or not listening to her, and she doesn't stand a chance. As we saw in that scene before, um, you know, like and like I sort of alluded to, she was kind of like damned if she does, damned if she doesn't. Because if she doesn't do anything, then AJ might have died. But if she does, obviously she's fighting against the doctors who have basically don't want to do anything with AJ. So, yeah, I think it's more just about the way she's been treated from the uh, the New Frontier rather than anything else. Um, Mika, it's my opinion anyway. Gabe. No. Kate. No. Please, Gabe. Please. I never thought I could be a mom. I never thought I wanted to be a mom. Until I met you and your sister. I'm begging you. Don't do this. It's my dad, Kate. I can't lose him again. And I can't lose you. Kate, we need to go. Now. With Look at me, Gabe. You. Please. No. No, she's stepmom. We don't, I don't. I couldn't tell you who like the real mum is though. I only know that she's stepmom from like listening to conversations and stuff. So it's not like directly said. I don't think. It's his father, Kate. It's what he wants, and this is what you want. What we want. She's gonna give him we a cold got so shoulder. Close in the last few years. I I thought Gabe would want to stay with us. I really saw him as my kid. I guess he didn't feel the same way. He's David's son. Not ours. No matter how long we've been taking care of him. You don't really think that. You can't. It's the truth. I'd hold it there, folks. And I'd consider explaining yourselves. I'd talk fast. Fast and clear. Easy now. We were just on our way out. That's him, right? The brother? Thought so. Bring him in. Baseball bat. Okay, it's going to end up getting shot. Keep I can see it. Run! Maybe not. I don't like your tone, David. If this is about your brother... Don't pretend like you don't know what this is about. You've got a lot to answer for. Me? You must be joking. What's this? They were trying to leave. Him and his lady friend. Leave? I asked you to get Kate and Gabe safe, not tuck your tail and run. Were you really gonna desert me when I needed you most? Richmond's not safe. It's no place for an injured woman and a boy. So you were just gonna leave me to it, huh? Mm -hmm. Where are they now? Girl got away. No sign of the kid. We'll deal with this later. You smuggled your brother into Richmond despite what we agreed. Clearly, you have no respect for any of us. 
That'd be interesting to get kicked out is now. Serious, David. You know we can't let this go. You don't deserve respect. Not after the things you've done. What? Um, it's so bad to be trusted, but nobody seems to trust her. We saw also in season one, and obviously season two. Maybe it's because she's relatively younger than the others. Yeah, I, I think like she was just like really young and naive in series series one, and um, you know, as much as Lee Lee sort of just showed up out of the blue and was just, like right place, right time to like look after her. And I think just um. I think as as time has gone on, it's like the more and more experiences she's had in the apocalypse as such, kind of like developed her as a person. Although she's still kind of a bit unsure about different bits and pieces, but clearly whatever's happened with the new frontier has kind of like cemented these ideas into her head. It's like, right, I can't trust people anymore and I need to be on my own. Um, as much as she's always been like part of a group and relied on people in the first it is a complete contrast to like the first and second episode where she was uh seasons where she was like really relying on people um she's now sort of like grown as a character and it's like okay well i don't need that anymore um people are assholes they can't be trusted and i'm just gonna do what i want to do so what things what's this all about but i think i think with the happy thing it's like because of like the way we've played the story at least is like we've like warmed to Clem a bit so she's kind of almost like getting that season one season two character back about herself now from what after after the experience of the new frontier and um, because of we've opened up and been warm to her she's like okay maybe I can trust people and maybe I can be part of a group and a community and you know, like a family sort of figure again so um interesting to see how like the next two episodes uh, play out as well I think uh, I'll She's sort of develop that a little bit more. On peaceful communities, sending your men to murder and loot. Really? Joan, is this true? <laughs> He's pointing the finger at everyone. First Badger, now me. That's a serious charge. You come in swinging, you better have proof. Here's our proof. This low life was part of the raids. I... Well, Max, what do you have to say? Don't be afraid of her, Max. We've got your back. Keep your word. Me, Badger, and, and Lonnie, we ran the ops. Off Jones' orders. God damn it, Max. I'm washing my hands of this, man. Joan. How could you? The real question is, how could I not? What would happen to us without your fertilizer, Clint? Or your pills, Paul? Do you think our community would survive? Yeah, Joan's basically gone behind the, the other leaders and she's basically kind of like, um, like almost like loot and pillage people. Um, don't care who you hurt, what you have to do. We just need to... Um, destroy communities and take everything they've got for ourselves sort of thing so yeah she is not a good person at all i did what i had to to ensure that we would so you survived but at what cost do you even know how much suffering you've caused i've no doubt it's less than i've prevented all of you remember the winter how much we lost friends Lovers. And that's just trying to justify herself. Children. I made a promise I would never let that happen again. The raids were just to keep us yeah. going till Richmond <laughs> reached sustainability. We're so close. So close to our dream. Do we really want to risk it all by fighting amongst ourselves? Talk about digging yourself out of a hole. We should all be on the same side of this, David. On Richmond's side. Surely you can see that. Prospering off the suffering of other people? That's no way to live. No way at all. You're damn right about that. We lost Mariana to those raids. How many others lost their kids too? I'm sorry, David. It breaks my heart about your child. It's... It's something I'm going to have to live with. It breaks my heart about your child. It's something I'm going to have to live with. But 
you know what? I don't care because I've got all your stuff. That's basically what she's saying. Take them. What the hell? Put them in a cell until I can figure out what to do with them. Don't you fucking touch me. That's an order. They don't take orders from you anymore, David. You're done here. You put yourself before the group. I hope you choke on your fucking cake. It looked like shit, by the way. <laughs> Paul, come on. I'm sorry. My hands are tied. Um, you're all under a thumb. Jeez. I have friends here. Allies. She's got you hook, line, and sinker, everybody. You fools. Guns will come in, custom guns now. Well, where is Clem? Well, 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 well. That's interesting, isn't it? I mean, so basically, it's all coming out really, like, of why Clem doesn't really like the New Frontier because clearly they are a bunch of scumbags. I mean, granted, she was more angry at David than anybody else, but I think that's just because David took the authority and the lead to like of actually kicking her out and separating her from AJ. Um, but like I said, in, in, I, I, she, she was in a really difficult position. It was like, try and help him or just uh, live with the fact that they said he can't be helped. And it's, you know, it's, it's not, it's not obviously confirmed, but you would assume from what we saw that obviously contrary to what the doctor said, uh, Clem giving AJ that shot saved his life and, and kept him alive. But that's assuming, of course that AJ is still alive. We don't know that for sure. We're only going on what David said. And there was a little moment there where Joan was talking about the winter and everything that they'd lost and that they'd lost the children. And David looked a little bit shifty. So I still don't know whether or not we got the truth about AJ, whether he is still alive or not, or whether that was just sort of David like trying to save his own bacon because he knew once he came into that room in that warehouse that he was going to get either some difficult questions or beat up or you know potentially even worse get killed so did he just come up with that on the fly as a way to stop Clem from you know hurting him even more I guess the answer to that is we're going to have to uh watch in the next episode which will uh we'll be playing on Wednesday night's stream now because of the football and everything tonight, I will say this in advance, Wednesdays will be very much like tonight's stream. It will start a lot later than usual because England play Wednesday night and I think it's an 8.30, 8, 8, 8 p.m. kickoff again. So, um, yeah, it will be a little bit later, probably around about 10 o'clock my time. So 12 for you, Mika. And Death Wish will be uh, what are you, four hours behind, five hours behind Death Wish. So that will be like five six o'clock for you death wish um but yeah we'll be back continuing on with episode four on uh wednesday night and uh that is actually gonna be it for the stream tonight guys i'm pretty beat and um i know there's maybe some people out there who want to do worms but uh yeah i'm i'm pretty beat tonight guys but uh, thank you very much everybody for tuning in i appreciate your support and uh, we're back with community chambers monday and uh, until then thanks guys and uh yeah. Enjoy the rest of your weekend. I've been knocking. You've been awesome. Catch you later. Bye-bye.